De Rose and Cavalier is a comic opera. It's a farce and it has all the elements of a comic opera. So, you know, you have men dressing up as women, you have mistaken identity, you have a young girl who wants to get out of an engagement. It's so beautiful. This Rose and Cavalier is so beautifully written. The orchestration is just fantastic. Even the characterization that he has written for the different characters. You can hear it in the music. Strauss is very special because, you know, he can just create magic in his scores. And, th and that's what he does, especially, I think, when Sophie enters and she meets Octavian for the first time. It just, it's ethereal and it's heavenly and, and he makes time stand still. The role of, of the Marshallin is gorgeous because she has some beautiful moments. She sings this gorgeous note in the first act and it's just a beautiful, it just takes one little moment to catch somebody. And that for me is my favorite, just one little note, but I love it. This is my first time singing the role of Sophie. So that's, um, that's really, really exciting, I have to say. She sings very high and it's very sustained singing as well. It's very, it's very pure and beautiful singing. It can be very effective to, to play with the colors of that. So, you know, to sing very high and to take it back to nothing and, and very, very soft singing as well. So, so to, to kind of float these, these, these notes and create a beautiful magic sound. You have Melancholy moments, I would say, where she ponders on the fact that she is so young and she's married to a much older man, but also that she feels, even though she's young, that in society she's getting older and how being older affects her and how it affects her psyche. I suppose it's a bit like uh, how I feel now in my 40s kind of looking at my life going, oh my God, I'm getting older now, and where's my life going, and where's my career going? And uh, in that way, I can identify very much with her. There are profound themes about social constructs, about gender in society, where women, where women fall in society, and um, how women navigate through that. It's just a lovely story, and it has so much elements in it, with uh, injected by humor, and uh, wit, a lot of subtext. It's just a very interesting opera and beautifully written and I think it will be an enjoyable evening for anybody to attend. I think Rosen Cavalier ticks all of the boxes um, for someone coming to opera for the first time. It's, it's funny, it's humorous, it's profound, the music is beautiful, uh, so what's not to love?